Hello everyone, and welcome to Songs by a Fireplace. Great job last night picking up Jeff Jefferson Airplanes, Somebody to Love. Um, <clears throat> the song was released in April of uh, 1967. Um, the uh, song was written by uh, Darby Slick. Originally uh, from the band uh, Great Society, uh, they actually called it Someone to Love. Um, they tried recording it, really didn't seem to go anywhere. And then um, his sister-in-law, of course, Gracie Slick, who became the lead singer for Jefferson Airplane, uh, when she moved to Jefferson Airplane, brought the song with her and then they redid it. And um, she actually did vocals on both versions but obviously it became a huge hit and uh an awesome tune um <clears throat> as far as the trivia questions uh concern uh the origin of the song well we just kind of mentioned it, it was from great society um who did a comedic version of it it was jim carrey uh in the movie cable guy <laughs> if you haven't seen it <clears throat> um it's pretty funny you should watch it um and uh, what prevented the uh, the uh, band from performing in an uh, outdoor free concert? Well, the fact that uh, apparently the city banned um, amplified uh, music, so um, they couldn't play. So there you go. <clears throat> um, and also, uh, there was a note uh, that when um, Gracie was uh, visiting uh, President Nixon, <clears throat> she was going to attempt, apparently, to uh, spike his one of his drinks with LSD or something, but that didn't happen. Uh, Secret Service caught on to that and um, ended that. <laughs> Just repeating what I read. <clears throat> so um, tonight I'm doing a mid '60s folk rock artist. Um, he's in his mid '70s right now. Um, still alive. Good thing. Um, and uh, this song is just um, known everywhere in the world. Uh, people hear it, they want to sing it, you want to sing along with it. It's almost kind of a, an anthem in a sense. Um, but um, yeah, uh, great tune, great tune. I actually had the opportunity to see this artist perform this song live in the Montreal Forum many, many years ago <laughs> when it was around and they were um, holding concerts there. Um, one of their uh, opening acts, I forget who the original band was, but one of the opening acts couldn't make it and um, they ended up bringing him in. And uh, I remember uh, from afar, he got up on stage uh, with his guitar and uh, played a couple of songs and this was one of them. So uh, pretty cool, pretty cool I think, when I think about it. Um, <clears throat> okay, so I'll stop talking and, and get to it. Um, Three questions, uh, trivia questions. Uh, one is, um, um, what inspired this song? What inspired this song? And uh, question number two, what famous nightclub did he play in? Famous, famous nightclub did he play in? And name five other famous artists who started there as well and there's like tons of them um you shouldn't have a problem picking names <laughs> um and the third one is <clears throat> um let's see um in this song <clears throat> this is related to question number one so in the song he refers um um, if it refers to something he was doing, <clears throat> excuse me, um, <clears throat> um, that's related to this inspired event, if that makes sense. So let me know what it, what it was he was doing at the time. <clears throat> there you go. So, uh, this is a pretty long song. Um, but obviously you're only going to get 
just a slice of it. So here we go, group artist, name of the song. song. Uh, it's my Friday. Glad to be off for a couple of days. Wash your hands lots. Don't text and drive. Exercise and socialize in small groups. Wear a mask if you can. Uh, say a prayer for all the healthcare workers and for all the sick people out there. And for God's sakes, be kind to each other. Talk soon.